Hello, I am Krishik Thomas Roy and I am here as an innovator to participate in the Anjani Marshalikar 2020 in Inclusive Innovations Award. So, I will be competing in the category of the COVID-19 uh, innovations. So, we all know we are in such a pandemic situation now. We have the coronavirus the world spread okay so there are many vaccines and many medicines and many creams have been on through the travel to contain this disease to create a vaccine but it is always prevention better than cure right so i'm here with an innovation which helps us to prevent coronavirus so, so there are two modes through which this virus spread. One is through air, which is it passes like a tiny droplets as we talk or sneeze or cough or anything. But for that we have a cheap and effective method which are wearing mask and so and being in social distancing, practicing social distancing. So here I am with my innovation for the second mode of transfer which is through contact. We know that we follow the social, social distancing principles but then to the contact doesn't mean a direct contact with the person but it means with the surrounding. As I have told you the disease are spread through by air or contact. And this contact means it could we know uh, we all know that we all practice social distance but the contact doesn't mean a direct contact with the person with the affected person but his presence in the surrounding can affect us so i'm here with my innovation which helps us to always be sanitized and fumigated for ourselves for our body for our hands or even for our goods or any bags that we carry we carry around so this is my product it is a wearable sanitization and a this is sanitization and a fumigator device let me show you so the principle is that it is always it is always uncomfortable for us to carry a bottle of sanitizer everywhere. Even if we have direct contact with a person or we have in direct contact with any surrounding, we use sanitizers. But we all use sanitization sanitizer bottles or spray cans everywhere we go. But it is very difficult to carry around. Uh, if you are going for a shopping or anywhere there are two things one we can carry a bottle around or we can use the public dispenser but that is that we should have been we should be in a queue that's called time consuming and it's also a risk of chance of getting the disease so and it is uncomfortable to carry around a sanitizer bottle so what I am here with is a wearable sanitization device which this device is hands free it sells our hands with an IR sensor and sprays the sanitizer to our hands so this is the device this is how it works we have a switch here oh, we have a switch on switch now it's switched on so the device has shown that there is a tank the device has its tank its battery for itself it's circuit everything and it's such design compact so this is a wearable sanitization device which i have developed for myself and i'll show you the process it's working so we just have to show our hands like this and space there is a sanitizer for yourself if you need again just keep it sanitizer it's that easy that comfortable and the main advantage of this this is 
wherever you go, we don't hesitate to uh, take this device with us because it's comfortable, it's safe within us, it's, uh, it's a very important thing that to be hand sanitized for ourselves, right? So this device is very efficient and comfortable, that's its principle. And why comfortness has this much priority, thing is that a person by feeling comfortable with an equipment, he always wants it around him, okay? If, if it is for a purpose, he will definitely use it as the comfort is more. So, if a sanitizer bottle is a person, if it is not comfortable for a person, he hesitates to take it. And it's a higher risk that when you go out, you have to be sanitized. When you have accidentally or when you go out, there might be a chance of contact. So you will have to take a sanitizer with you because soap and water we cannot take them everywhere. In home it's okay, but we cannot take it to everywhere. Right? So such a comfortable mode of or a device is needed for our people, for them to be safe, to be comfortable around it. So if we take the other features for this, okay? Uh, if you go going to a shopping mall or complex and uh, we see a rack of things okay so we want that to be sanitized okay so this is another mod for this equipment let me show you so this is the other mod which i have told you this is a spray gun which is attached to the tank so if we see some things we can go and just spray the sanitizer all the products which will sanitize the product so that it is uh, safe for us to grab and go. I'm sorry, it is lovely because it's a prototype which I have made and uh, I was very lack in time for this competition and also I'm in a contingency zone because it is an Argo so I cannot go out and purchase things and come back because all <coughs> Uh, all the shops and everything is closed. If I ever wanted to order online or through via Amazon, one thing it's expensive, and another thing is the because the country is on there's no delivery to this area, so I was in a really big trouble. But still, I've managed to develop this prototype using things from my home itself. So this is a prototype which I have made and this is through which you fill in sanitizer I'll show you. <laughs> See, this is through which you fill sanitizer and <coughs> sanitizer, sanitizer. After that you can close. You can put the cap off can it's ready to go. And the working is that you see from here to this arm of the device is the tank. This is where the sanitizer is found. Here I have placed a submersible water pump which pumps sanitizer through this pipe. This pipe. Alright. And its circuit goes through this wire. Okay. And this arm of the device is where it holds all the electrons. Here, the enters through this pipe, this wire enters through it, it's a hole here. And inside this, we have the battery. I have added 9 volt battery here. We don't need 9 volt battery, we just need 5 volt battery. But uh, for, I, I couldn't purchase it anymore. But the thing which I've got in my house, I've uh, placed it here. And if there is a re we can in a production model we can use we should use the re uh, rechargeable battery 5 volt battery and that's cheap too. And here we have the infrared IR sensor. We'll just switch on it. See, so the red light is on. And when it changes on my hand, it sprays. It sprays right. When it sees my hand, it sprays. So this is the uh, advantage of this IA sensor because we doesn't need any contact, it is contactless. 
so that is one method easy method to use this product and safe too and now talking about the amount of rupees which i have spent on this product just 300 rupees you can even believe it for a prototype it's been tested and all everything is tested and things have done have made this all with just 300 rupees and cost this water pump cost 100 rupees this sensor cost me 70 rupees the switch this cap and other parts all cost me 100 rupees, around 100 rupees and all the MC which I have used just cost me a total of 300 rupees so that cheap and cheap of price but affordable it is affordable but the thing is that the product can it is affordable but it is on good features and quality you can always rely upon this which is just a product which i have made within one day uh, it is just to prove that this innovation this idea really works my true design was not to fit a water pump here because it adds weight and plus it is more expensive okay it's, it costs 100 rupees so in my design what i decided was to put on ultrasonic mist plates which we all use in humidifiers and other things that's the technology what they use it is cheap the technology is way cheaper than this air pump and it is it is affordable right? so when we add it that to its product it reduces space just a disc it reduces space plus it is cheaper and it doesn't need this connections and all so that plate itself space out we don't need it in the nose so if we are adapting to that we can have two nozzles two spray nozzles so that both have the same time can be sanitized so that's what's the design which i had in my mind but i couldn't i will i couldn't purchase this parts because of this covid situation here but it really works uh, i'll show you some pictures about it because we can find those in amazon and other things like uh, it, it is a simple technology but it is very reliable uh, and it's very cheap too and another thing is that this ir sensor there's a small uh, drawback with the uh, with, with, which we buy from outside uh, ready made IR sensors which are just for some small projects but when we are producing it we have to be the IR sensor should be accurate and correct right and those uh, I I know how to assemble it and the circuit I know the circuit but uh, I couldn't get all the gauge uh, didn't get uh, all the resistors which I wanted so I just bought the ready made one if I had uh, the, the they had the resistors so I could install in a circuit board I, I could have made a IR sensor which is more cheaper than this this costs 100 rupees and which I assembled this cost me 50 rupees so if we are producing it with an efficient design we can really affordable in affordable way we can produce it and give out for the world so everyone can use it and it is a great product and also we can also use this as a fumigator you know how the same nozzle works and when we add the attraction mist plates it won't be spraying it will be mist mist will come in, will come out which helps us to use less sanitizer for a large coverage area so uh, as we make it I'll add a press switch here so as we press it if we keep a bag or any items if it's a headphone itself we can fumigate the headphone using this or even if it's a bag even if it's a bag you have fumigator so you can fumigate the bag it is very handy and 
this product this products main advantage is that this is a fumigator plus a sanitizer a hand sanitizer and all a surrounding sanitizer so this is the advantage the people who buy this just for 400 500 rupees sorry it will cost around in production model like cost around 300 to 500 in range the amount of money so the people can buy this because the fumigators in the market are very expensive they are for the large scale fumigating purposes which are used in hotels or things but it is expensive and cannot be used for personal protection and it, it is not affordable so why a person spending uh, amount uh, below than 500 rupees are getting hand sanitization device plus he is getting uh, a fumigator and another thing is that if we if, if we use starting start use using this device we can uh, we, uh, the bottles and sanitizer spray cans which we buy we can uh, avoid it and thus if we buy sanitizer bottles or any types of spray cans after its use is the empty cans are just a waste it is just a waste to the environment so we can also save our environment this is this product innovation has also been up to an eco-friendly thing so this is the prototype which i have in a protection idea which i have i have made with thermocons not perfect because i lacked in time that's why so this is the prototype all the electronics go in here only the disc plates are here and these two are the sensors the infrared sensors all the battery and the chip uh, the ic all get be, will be inside this electronic and this whole thing will be the sanitizer tank so we have more space to accommodate the sanitizer so that a day or a two day of use is very essential with this so we can we can easily with this amount of sanitizer i think it'll be around we can accommodate I think we can accommodate 250 ml of sanitizer with this such a eminem design so that it is very efficient for, for surviving two days and after two days we can refill through through uh, refill the tank by uncapping the cap, uh, cap and uh, pouring the sanitizer and by we are using this is also another important feature that we just need to we can buy sanitizers in bulk so we can also save money we can buy large cans of sanitizers and so, so so there are many affordable things which we can do and this is very comfortable and let's save uh, uh, our community and this uh, innovation uh, it's not a business i am delivering it out because I want this COVID-19 cases or this community spread to stop and thus this innovation is a very good example for that. Thank you and I hope it gets selected. Thank you. Thank you. I am of 19 years of age. I know I have seen the previous year uh, competitors and the winners I know and I am very <laughs> and they are all of very uh, aged than more elder than me. I know I am young but I hope this innovation changes changes the world it uh, changes this corona virus pandemic situation and i pray uh, i'm pray and hope for the best thank you thank you